Hey what's up, my name is Erica, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a video on this look that I have on today. This is like a no makeup makeup look, so it's kind of like on those days when you don't want to wear too much makeup, or at least you don't want to make it look like you're wearing too much makeup, you want it to look like as natural as possible, if that makes any sense. It's my go-to look 99% of the time, so um, yeah, you don't want to miss it, okay? So keep watching. Let's get on with the video. I already have my face primed and I have my eyebrows done, so let's go ahead and get started with this look. Today's look is going to be like a no makeup makeup look. So it's like um, on those days when you don't want, I guess, too much makeup on, or you don't want to at least make it look like you have too much makeup on one of those days so um one of those type of looks pretty much so i'm gonna go in my face the primer has already set into my face so um i'm gonna go in with the l'oreal infallible um 24 hour fresh wear foundation looks like this this has been my go-to lately shake it up a bit i love this foundation because it's not like full coverage off the bat it is like about a, I would say like medium coverage and then um, you can definitely uh, build it up if you want to but if you don't like full coverage and you just want to like, you know, have like a fresh little or just cover up like me, I would, I love using um, on days, on my no makeup makeup days, I like having like just a light uh you know like not too much just enough to cover up some of my redness but not like overboard so I'm gonna go ahead and blend this in so this is what one um, one layer looks like which I like it some of my redness is seeping through like I said but I don't mind because the less the better um, for concealer I'm gonna go in with the Fenty Beauty I love the Fenty Beauty concealer I feel like um, it gives you that perfect amount of like coverage but not it's not like super super full coverage where um, you know it's just a perfect amount of coverage and it is so creamy okay guys like this is the creamiest concealer that I've ever used and I just love it because it makes it so easy to blend in and I'm all about that set my under eyes I'm gonna go in with the Fenty Beauty powder love this powder it is my favorite like uh, powder ever I recently just bought the born this way um, powder by Too Faced and for some reason I don't know it wasn't my favorite it's like whatever I'm trying to make this look natural or as natural as possible so um it was like maybe two minutes now I'm gonna go ahead and um bounce this brush like pat it into my skin pat all the powder into my skin and then swipe so after I have patted it into my skin I swipe just to get rid of any extra but you want to like pat that powder into your skin so that's done. Um, now I'm gonna go in with a blush. The one I'm gonna be using today is the um, Nars Orgasm. I'm gonna use a little bit of this. This is just like a deluxe size, I guess, but. Once I 
do run out of it, I'm definitely going to purchase the big size, um, the regular size one because I just love it so much. So after this, um, I don't know, I always have to bronze my skin at least a little bit. I'm going in with the Physicians Formula one, looks like this, butter bronzer, I love this one. This one's like my favorite bronzer ever. <laughs> time going in with the covergirl ex exhibitionist love this mascara favorite mascara ever first i go ahead and comb my eyelashes whenever i'm going to put on mascara um if i'm not going to be using falsies i i definitely go in and curl my eyelashes before if i'm going to be putting on falsies i do not i'm going to go ahead and curl my eyelashes you know um, the falsies love this uh, mascara for my bottom lashes my go-to recently fallen um, I've fallen back in love with the um, back I guess like a Last year, or the year before that, I used to be obsessed with using this Maybelline New York Expert Wear Eyeshadow in the Glow Down. Roxette Arisa kind of got me, um, you know, she got me onto this. Sorry, it's like a bit dusty in here, but this is how it looks. And I am loving it again. It is just such a great highlighter. Or eyeshadow, but, you know. We use it for highlighters. I like love it so I've kind of been obsessed with this one um, lately to top all of this off I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the Fenty Beauty gloss bomb looks like this I got mine in fussy So if you have not tried this um, gloss by Fenty Beauty, you guys need to try it. You guys are missing out. Great, great formula. Love it. I think she has three different um, kinds, which I'm about to go pick up the other two um, whenever I get the chance because they are that good. So to finish off this whole look, I'm going to go ahead and spray myself once again with the Catrice Prime and Fine. And then I'm also going to go in with the Make It Last by Milani. So this completes my look. I hope everyone enjoyed this video. This look is like my go-to 99% of the time. It's um, natural looking, um, quick and easy. I can literally get this done in like 10 minutes if I wasn't explaining everything in this video. Um, yeah, so it's super quick and easy and um, looks natural, you know? So um, if you liked this video, go ahead and give it a like down below. And if you have not joined my YouTube channel, and if you have not joined my YouTube family, please do so by subscribing down below and also click that notification bell next um, next to it so that you can get notified every time I upload a video, which I've been trying to upload a video twice a week. Um, yeah, so I'll catch y'all in my next video. Bye!